Got a doll, baby. I love her so. Nothing else like her anywhere you go. A man, she anything. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Nuka World. As you can see, we are here at the Fizz Top Grill. We made it back safe and sound. And since I had gotten that last rifleman perk, I was able to upgrade my gun. Well, not without a ton of searching for screws. I had to scour Nuka World, or rather just Nuka Town, you want to say, for screws because I didn't have enough to do anything with, even, even with all the collecting I've been doing. It was quite annoying. Anyways, so I upgraded that gun. Let's take it out here into the sunlight. Isn't it beautiful? So this is what I done to it. <clears throat> I'll just show ya. Um, what was it called? Here we go. This one. So, I put a suppressor on it. I painted it a different color because I thought it was too bright. I like darker guns. And... It does 211, no, 136 damage now. And it was something like, can't remember what it was when I first found it, something like 40 something. So it improved it a ton. I put a larger magazine on it. Um, I put the um, large quick eject mag on it. Uh, I didn't change the stock because I don't have the perks for it. You need. Um, you, I, you need perks that I don't have in order to change the stock. So I didn't do that. And I didn't put... There was another thing I couldn't do. I can't remember what it was now. Oh, I was going to put... Instead of a suppressor, I was going to put a bayonet on the end and make it a shorter barreled gun. But for some reason, I need unarmed perks to put a bayonet on the end of my gun. How stupid is that? I didn't need unarmed perks to do that for my combat rifle. I mean combat shotgun. So that was stupid. But whatever. I don't know how to tie a bayonet on the end of I don't know how to tie a knife on the end of my rifle for some reason. Because <laughs> I'm not a very good fist fighter. However, that has anything to do with it. So... There it is. And I also bought some ammo for it because it didn't have very much. I only had like 40 rounds for it. So I bought some ammo. Yeah. Now, I had a request from somebody quite a while, a couple episodes ago. I, I tend to record these a couple at a time back to back. So um, I, if there's a request that I do a certain thing, um, the request won't show up for a few episodes. So sorry that it took so long. But uh, somebody requested that I show what my guns are, my current guns. I, it's been a long time since I've done this. I did that back in chapter one. I think that was the last time I did it. So I thought maybe I should do it now. So the combat rifle. Oh, I also upgraded my combat rifle. It is now a 308 because it was just a 45 before. And... So it's got a long light barrel, marksman stock, large magazine, uh, reflex sight, and a large bayonet on the end. Um, I don't use it very often. It's more of my short range weapon. I could probably put a shorter, a shorter barrel on it and it would be better for short range. But there you go. And it currently does 114 damage. So... And I have way too much ammo for that one. My combat shotgun, which I was currently using a lot with the ghouls. Advanced receiver, which is the highest one I can get. Uh, long ported and shielded barrel. Recoil compensating stock. Quick eject drum mag. Uh, front sight ring and a large bayonet. And does 174 damage. Plus, it's also... Um, 
A legendary it does 50% more limb damage. So I think it's a pretty good shotgun. I I really like it. I think I can't remember what this one was. This one had a this was I think a unique shotgun that I found that had a name I changed the name because I like to keep all of my guns in the same place in my inventory so it's easier to find them. And the hunting rifle, 50 caliber, long light barrel, marksman stock, large magazine, reflex sight, and suppressor. And it's 128 damage. And my sniper rifle, also 128 damage, 50 caliber. It's basically the an exact duplicate of my regular hunting rifle. It just has a scope. So, <clears throat> there you go. <laughs> so now, this one actually is my best gun. 136 damage. So I'm going to be using this for a while and see how it handles. Um, it came with the scope. I might take the scope off. I might shorten the barrel to use it more as a short range gun. I don't know. I don't know yet. My sniper rifle, my hunting sniper rifle, does pretty good um, for sniping. So I might use this more as a short range weapon. But for now, I'm going to keep it as a sniper rifle just because that is what it came as. Um, and then if I don't like it as a sniper rifle, I'll change it. I'll take the scope off. Anyway, also, I would appreciate your guys' suggestions about what you think I should do with this gun. Should I keep it a sniper rifle? Should I have it a long distance uh, gun without a scope? Or should I have it as a short range gun? I'm going to keep the suppressor on it um, no matter what, just because I like to be more silent. My combat rifle doesn't have a silencer because I want the bayonet, but... I don't know. So many chumps, so little time. <laughs> my combat rifle isn't as loud as my hunting rifle. Oh, anyway, so now, let's see. I went and sold, like, everything. I even sold all the ammo that I had because I had to buy a bunch of ammo. I bought more Rad X and Rad Away, so now I have you know, 25. I, I only had two left, or two, two or three left. So now I have 25. Still not a lot, but it's better than three. So I bought a bunch of Red X, and that costed a ton of money. So I traded lots and lots of ammo that I don't need anymore, and I actually don't have any excess ammo left. I've sold all of it. It's morning, I believe. Yes, I just woke up. And now we have other things to do. We have to... So we secured Kitty Kingdom. Now we need to go to Dry Rock Gulch, the Safari Adventure, or the Bottling Plant. Or... Oh, hold on. Um, no, how do I... There. Or Galactic Zone. There, there were, there were four of them. Oh. What I wanted to do was get my map up. So, okay, so we did Kitty Kingdom. And I even found two Cappies there. And the next closest one is the Galactic Zone. Plus, you know, what was that? Hubologist Camp. I wonder why that's showing up. Did somebody mention that before? Um... There's something over here that we could go check out as well. Um, there's something there. And there's this thing up here on the hill that we saw from up above. So there's a lot to see outside the park, actually. So we might want to go do that as well. Do a little bit of exploring. But for now... What's that? Oh, Nickel World Red Rocket. Right. What's this? That's where we saw the, all the gunners. Okay, now I have to decide which one to go in next. Probably this one. Just because. It's closer. 
Um, one, two... So there's two Cappies in the Galactic Zone. And the Galactic Zone is... No, it's this way, right? Yeah. Well, they, all of them are this way. <laughs> Alright, well let's go out. Try out the new gun. I have a feeling I'm going to regret having the scope on this thing. Piper, I, I really do. I feel like I'm going to regret having the scope. Because I want to try it out on whatever just happens to come upon me and I don't want to... I'm going to take the scope off, you guys. Oops. Just because... I, maybe, maybe I'll put it back on later. I need to... Oh, you know what? I can't. Because I don't have any stuff on me. I, I got rid of it all. Okay, the very next opportunity that I have to put that... To take that off. Wait, what did it need? It needed adhesive and... What? To take off the scope? Steel. Ugh! I have all that stuff up in the... Okay, no. Nisha seems to think you I'm just gonna go back up and get it. It's up in the chest. I didn't want to carry it all around with me because Sometimes I don't works in your favor if you see it I don't need it all with me all the time, right? I, and I'm going to be collecting more of it. So I'm just going to quickly get some. I got some steel and some adhesive. And so now I can take off the scope. It's annoying. Oh, but mm, I don't know if I want standard sights now that I uh, think about it. I probably want a reflex sight. I just like them better. Aluminum, glass, nuclear material, and screws. <sighs> Why didn't I think of that before? I don't know. There. All right, that was hard. <sighs> I had to go back and forth another three times because. Oh yeah, look at that. Nice. Okay, because I kept forgetting things, and it needed silver, which was odd because I didn't see that at first. It was. Mhm. Mm anyway. So, my large quick eject mag only has three shots in it. I'm um, not three. Thirty! Um, I guess I'm using- I, I, I got used to my shotgun. But it has a drum. Oh, it was the drum I couldn't make. It was the drum mag I couldn't make because I didn't have the right perk. I needed- I needed co the commando perks. Which is like a stupid- since I didn't need the commando perks to put the drum on my shotgun. Whatever. Inconsistent there. Alright, so here we are in the... Ooh. Bad weather suddenly. So there's like some dead people lying there. And a bunch of robots. This does not bode well, Piper. Excuse me. Dead people and robots. And, ugh. Star control. Investigate the battle site. Tina Alston. Tiana. Oh, Tiana Alston. Alston. Bleh. Tiana's log. Better in our hands anyway. Read Tiana's log. Traitors. They're traitors. Hmm. So these are like kind of Nuka World themed robots. 
Nuka Cola recording. Probably don't need that. I'll take it anyway. <laughs> okay, let's look up Tiana's log. And of course, oops, wrong. Wrong! There. Tiana's recording is going to be near the bottom. Did you hear that? Sound like an announcer. Tiana's log. Okay, it is text. Dad said we're heading out to the Galactic Zone again tomorrow. I'm still not sure how I feel about these salvage runs. It's amazing to see how much of the old text still works. I wish I could stay and study it all. But Dad's crew is just there to rip it apart and haul it back for scrap. As if the world didn't have enough rusted metal and broken circuit boards already. <laughs> yeah, right. At least I only have to tackle, uh, take half shifts. I'm looking forward to getting back to my work on Star Control. I just hope the old mainframe is still running. Hmm. It's all my fault, I told him. I told him there weren't enough cores left to turn it on. If he had waited an hour, we could have pulled them from around the zone, gotten Star Control back up and running. I already had people looking. I could have made it work, but he wouldn't listen. He wouldn't listen, and now... God, I hope he's alright. I can hear the screams. We're going to wait for nightfall, then make a run for the gate. Oh no. Something... Wow, that's too bad. So, her dad went in. This woman's dad went in to look for something about star control. And then they tried to get away and ended up getting killed. That's too bad. That's really too bad. Hmm. I'm not going to pick that up. I know. I could use it for screws, but I don't want to carry it. Or should I? I don't really need to upgrade any more guns. At least not right now, I don't. Because I upgraded everything as much as I can, pretty much. Alright, I suggest we sneak Piper. I have a feeling we're going to be shooting a lot of robots. Oh, and turret. Piper. No. Uh oh. Yeah, that's not good. Woo. We got we got them all. Well, that's nice. This gun is so quiet. The silencer, I tested it before I put the silencer on. It was really loud. Piper? You okay? These things have propellers. Why? Piper? Where'd you go? Are these like Mr. Handies? There you are, okay. But they have propellers on their feet. That's different. Okay. Well, this place is something. All right. Shh. Okay, that was a nice fast reload. Oh man, there's another one over here. What in the world? Don't forget to stake out a good spot for the Fizz Top Mountain Fireworks Spectacular this evening. Show starts oh, another trader. Huh. A lot of traders. Heh. 
Why were they here? So they were here just to look for some star control thing. I wonder what that is and why it's so important yes. that they would completely like just give up their lives for it. Huh. I don't know why I'm still collecting stuff. It's sort of a habit now. Stuff, though. Okay, we need to keep an eye out for robots and turrets. I see another robot up there. World of refreshment rides now featuring delicious Nuka Cola Quantum. Anyone decides to pick a fight with us out here, we're in trouble. Oh no. Tonight's showing at the Starlight Interstellar know, like Theater it. will be Night of the Fishman's Revenge. Not recommended for children under five. Children under five. Okay, is any movie in a the theater recommended for children under five? I would like to know. So there's an iBot patrolling up there on that walkway. Oh. Wow, I wonder if we're going to go up there. I wonder if we can. You don't see very many skeletons lying around. Nuka World's Great Halloween Spooktacular will begin next week. Reserve your tickets for this nighttime event at the main box office. Mm -hmm. Oh, they have rides here too. Spaceship rides. They had spaceship rides in Kitty Kingdom. This one's a little bigger, though. They they go up higher. Okay, what was looking at us? What was that? Thirsty? Hey, I'm here. The Dot Bomb Base Saloon in Dry Rock Gulch to purchase an ice cold Nuka Cola Wild. Moon Piper! Piper! You need to fall back with me. Okay, you're getting in my shot, and if I shoot you, it's not my fault. Honestly. Nuka World is Anymore? proud to be the only East Coast location serving Nuka Cola Courts and Nuka Cola Victory. Try one today. No, there's one way over there. Okay. There's still others somewhere. Please get out of my face. All right. There's the turret. Where is it at? There it is. Still more. <laughs> Somewhere. Tokens for the Midway Games are available at any one of the marked token dispensers. Okay, so Gulch. let's just loot these guys. I'm it's getting a lot waste, of military circuit boards, but they have... That's a good start. Now just keep running and we'll call it even. No! Now I'm going to kill you. That's a better idea. Is he inside a glass thing? Yeah, he is. I think he might be the only one left in here. In this area. Piper? You're blocking me now. Come on. Starlight Interstellar Theater. This is like the Starlight Drive-In. And the same people own it. Starlight. I 
Same theater chain, I guess, is what I meant to say. I hear footsteps. Like up there. Oh, I just heard a turret disengage as well. So we're not completely out of the woods yet. Hmm. I need to get around and shoot that thing. I wonder if it's... Can I shoot it through here, though? No. That is a good question, actually. Starlight Interstellar Theater. Was it shooting? Still in one piece. Was it shooting Nuka Cola or something? Water? Actually? Oh, back to the usual daily tedium. There's one up there. Can't see it though. It has shotgun shells on it. That's weird. Okay. What are these? Nuka grape. Nuka cherry. I don't need the cherry. Those are everywhere. Can I get in here? I probably don't need any more of those things. It's kind of hard to leave them there, though. <laughs> You. I probably don't need any more of those either, actually, come to think of it. How do I get out of here? How do the people who work here get out of this thing? There's not a door. Oh, are those those magnet things? Yeah. The cow magnets and things. Hmm. <laughs> Okay, so there's a theater here. Should we go in it? Or should we go up there first? Because we can go up there. We can go up that way. There's a lot of directions to go. But I'm liking this gun. Can I activate the ride? No, because the main power's out. So if we got the main power running somehow... We could actually get the rides running again. Oh! Alright, well, why don't we go inside here, Piper? This might be interesting. Blue, you got a minute? No, I don't, actually. You should pick the worst times, Piper, honestly. Can you hear? There's gunshots in here. Oh, no. You know what that sound is? I do. But that is not a fun sound. That is the worst sound possible. Okay. <sighs> this is not going to be nice. Who's shooting something? Shooting at us. Back for more, huh? <coughs> oh, get out. Ow. Ow. That hurt. Whatever it was shooting, that hurt. That was. Yeah. 
It was spraying something at us. Was it spraying Nuka Cola at us? It was dark like Nuka Cola. That was weird. Okay, so there's a sentry bot in there, and I'm not happy about this. You know what I want to do is put my. Um. Which one was it? Where is it? Pulse grenades. I'm going to put my pulse grenades on my. Uh, let's see. I don't really need my campfire on there right now. Do I have any pulse spines? Yes, I do. Okay. Let's try this again. Okay. Hopefully they're not just inside waiting for us. Okay. I think they forgot about us. That's good. Kind of nice that I can they... carry something if you need me to. Kind of nice that they don't um, think we're worth going out of their way for. <laughs> Let's go this way. Cool. There's an elevator. What are they showing on the TV? On the, I mean, on the theater screen. It looks like a naked guy for a second there. Alright, where is this thing? Oh, they made it look like a drive-in, only with rocket ships instead of cars. It's kind of fun. Where is this thing at, I wonder? The sentry bot, I mean. I hear a turret. Okay, we can go up there as well. Anything, damn. Lost her. Is that it? Good for you. Really? That was amazing. like something inside there as well. Okay, I really need to stop picking up stuff off these robots. I'm going to get over encumbered. Hey, I see you. Oh, seriously. Showed them. Showed them. This turret didn't even uh see us at first. That's interesting. I didn't hear it either. Theater pantry key. Might we need that, I wonder. So I feel like there's another turret on the other side of this door. Yeah. I still feel like there's one in there. What am I getting stuck on? I'm getting stuck on that. Piper, move! No, there's not another turret in here. But there's a Nuka Cola Victory. A Star Core. Should I take it? 
I I don't know. I feel like it's important. Oh. Star Command. I wonder if they're related. Probably. I found a couple other star cores. Other places. Excuse me. Piper. I found one in like I can't remember, but I just found one the other day in, um... Not the other day, but last night. While I was searching for screws, That's it. I found one in... Um... In the market. It was just sitting on a table, so I took it. Because it wasn't stealing to take it. Okay. Let's see. Who is shooting? I do not see. I hear a turret. I can hear a turret in there. Where the uh, where's the sentry bot at? There it is. All right. I bet it won't go through here. I bet it can't. Whoa, it's got something on it. Are those... Rocket launchers? I don't remember... Sentry bots having those, but maybe I just don't remember. Hmm. Alright, well let's see. I'm going to put a pulse mine here, just... Just in case. It comes this way. Okay, I knew there was a turret around here somewhere. I could hear it, so it saw me. It's right above us. How it didn't see me that whole time. Excuse me, Piper. Oh no. Close. Uh, yeah. I can't feel my arm. Sorry. Piper, you okay? Galactic technician. Okay, we gotta get some cover here. <clears throat> Just Pi Piper, cover. I said cover. Alert hostile skin. Okay, it blew up my my mind. Attention, fugitive should be considered armed and dangerous. I need to kill the one that's ab above us, but I can't shoot it through the grate. Your attention escape is only making things worse for you. Okay, there it is. <laughs> I don't think the sentry bot's going to come out here. It would have done it by now. Do not attempt to flee. You will be identified. Wow. It has rocket launchers. That I've never seen one like that before. We better be careful and not get in its line of sight. Okay, got that one. What was its name? 
star or something? Okay, I think I got all the ones. You okay? That wall's pretty tough, isn't it? Whoa. These are probably not going to do just a whole lot of damage to it, <laughs> but... My guy. I know. Well, I want to. Yes, I do. I don't think that actually bothered it, though. Okay, Piper? No, I'm not hitting it. Okay, I hit it that time. Whoa. I missed it that time though. I only have a couple of these left. But real bombs, I'm uh, real bombs. Explosive bombs work on sentry bots as well. So. Oh, that one had a really delayed reaction. Okay. Um, do I have any other more powerful grenades? Let's see, I have a plasma one. Let's use that. I don't know if plasma works on robots, but I'm gonna try it. Uh, he's recharging. No! Yeah, I don't think that actually hit him. Okay, what else do I have? I have nuka grenades. Ooh, let's try one of those. <laughs> Whoa, did it get in? Oh my gosh, Pfeiffer! I should have used one of those from the beginning. <laughs> Thanks, Blue. You're welcome. Alright, we still got a lot of them out there. Got a doll, baby. I love her so. Nothing else like her anywhere you go. A man, she's anything but calm.